My name is Sebastian Matthias Weisbach and I'm the writer and director of Crossroads and your support can help our team make our fairy tale come true. Crossroads is the story of Nerissa and Aoife, two best friends that venture out on a summer holiday but have a fateful accident on the road. After killing a lone young woman in the middle of the night, they decide to keep the death hush-hush and bury the body in the woods. But Nerissa is haunted by dark dreams that tell her <laughs> Crossroads is a fairy tale with elements of horror. A haunting story of what grim fairy tales could look like in the 21st century. Brutal, bloody, and filled with the dread of cosmic horror. A world older than we can imagine playing tricks on us. Hi, my name is Marla Javiera and I'm an actress and I'm playing Nerissa. Nerissa is a character that is currently and probably always has been bogged down by life's circumstances and in this moment those circumstances are accidentally killing a woman out into the road when she's going on vacation with her best friend. And after this, um, because of the guilt and the horribleness of the whole situation, she starts feeling really bad about everything and also starts getting really strange dreams, which kind of then sets the question of the film whether she's imagining all this or not and whether her best friend Eva is in on it or not. We'll see. I'm Valerie Mae Fox and I'm an actress and I'm gonna be playing Eva in Crossroads. Eva walks through life very lightly. She comes across as very caring and warm, but there's way more layers to her which will be revealed throughout the film. There's something very princessy about her and her and Marissa's relationship is very special. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, my name is Shivani Bajaj and I play the Deer Woman. She's still alive. And a little bit about the Deer Woman, I would say, to be honest, she's more of a feeling. Like, I think she just expresses and perfectly defines existentialism and the feeling of being cast out by a world that you no longer understand. Um, and for the rest, you'll have to see the movie. Two years ago, we produced an indie feature film on a shoestring budget that has been screened at film festivals the world over. With our second film, we aim to be more ambitious and create a truly unique and truly indie piece of thrilling horror bliss. It's a fairy tale. It's a really dark fairy tale. A few reasons why I think you should support this film are, first of all, it is a predominantly female-led cast, which is great, and I think it really really um, depicts female rage in an interesting way. I also think it really explores people embracing and understanding their darkness and learning how to harness that through the lens of fantasy, which is interesting and scary and just a lot of very exciting things that you'll be happy to see in the film. We're putting our heart and soul into this film and we would really appreciate your support. You should support this project because we are professionals that are gonna do an incredible film because we only do great things and it's just gonna be better with you guys' support. If you believe it's unrealistic to shoot a compelling indie feature on a micro budget, all I can say is we've done it before. We can do it again. No, it's your wife said. What did she say? Things we can realize even without a big budget and I say that with confidence no other team in the world can do. And with your help, you can become our wishing star, our fairy godparent, our encouraging mirror telling us how beautiful we are. Your support would mean the world to us and help us craft a unique modern fairy tale into a film with the scope it deserves. Thank you for watching and... And we'll see you at the crossroads. 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 See you at the crossroads.